Sambuike, governor of River State, presented 200 million naira to victims of bandit tree and other violent confrontations in the state on Monday in Kaduna. According to Wike, who was in the state as part of his consultation to seek the People's Democratic Party's presidential ticket in 2023, the donation was for the maintenance of the state displaced persons who had experienced attacks over the years. The governor, while addressing PDP members at the party's secretariat in Ongwan, Sanu, old NDA Kaduna lamented plight of the citizens of Kaduna State as a result of terrorist operations in the state. While announcing the donation to assist victims of attacks in the state, Wiki stated that insecurity would be a thing of the past if he were to become the country's next president. He said, I am here today to declare that this country is in desperate need of rescue. He stated, he came here. We came here to com- emphasize the importance of not carrying sentiment into the 2023 election. We came here to inform you that the PDP now requires someone who is courageous and capable of defeating this party and winning the 2023 election. I am not here to inform you that I am merely a presidential aspirant. I am here to tell you that I am to win the election if you grant me the ticket on May 29 and 30, 2022. The condition our country finds itself in order a, under APC is no longer a tale. Take Kaduna State as an example. It is one of the most tranquil states in the country, with people traveling freely. No northern leader will claim that he does not own property in Kaduna State. People can leave Abuja at 10 p.m. and travel to Kaduna. When I was a minister, I traveled by road, but what has happened since then? Kaduna has lost its glory as a result of the government's inefficiency. Wike Wu is also a PDP presidential candidate, stated that he was in the state to court PDP delegates ahead of the party's presidential primary. He then begged the delegates to rally behind him and give him 80% of their votes stating that at least 60 of the state's 78 delegates should vote for him, with the remaining 18 delegates being shared among other hopefuls. Senator Ahmad McAfee, Ahmed McAfee, a former governor of Cardona State, responded that he would make Governor Wiki president if he had the power as a result of his contribution to the party's survival through its tough times. Hmm. Well... I was expecting Wiki to settle his uh, people so that they can help him. But I think uh, he's t- trying to wet the ground in case he gets the PDP tickets that the state, the people also will vote for him. And that is the reason why he went there. I would have expected him to just settle his party delegates, his party people, and that's it. But going ahead to give them 200 million naira. And a lot of people are really... Uh, having that there are a lot of missed reactions concerning this uh, donation the other day tinubu donated 50 million naira in lagos tinubu donated 1 billion naira to lasso and people begin to ask let's even leave tinubu out of this equation but let's come to wiki wiki one is that where did he get the money from is it from the river state money he got the money from because now we Understand that some people are being owed salaries, whether pensions or whatever. In that state, a lot of people are crying. Even the last time he donated, I think, a 50 million, you know, it's 500 million naira to this state, Tambua state, Sokoto state, when uh, they said they, there was fire incident also. And the pensioners or some people, some group of people came out and said, the government has been owing them. Why is it like that? Is it his own personal money? that is donating or is the government's money that is donating if it's his own personal money well investigation must be done thoroughly because there's this form they filled before this uh, asset declaration before they uh, uh, became what they become now that he's a governor uh, what was he doing what business was he doing before he joined politics so at the end of the day, what is his salary scale as a as a as a governor and the, a lot of people say, oh, eh, do you know that he's a governor? Do you know how much he's receiving? Because all of us encourage corruption. Because if we want to look at all this whole thing thoroughly, you will see that what they are spending, you cannot equate it with what they are getting. 
Everybody will say, oh, forget. Or many people, not everybody. Because some people don't even want to think anything. Oh, chop, I chop. And that's why they will tell you, oh, during Babangi, that's time. It's a chop and chop. You know, they hold anybody. You know, they will do this and that. And that is why this country is, is, is where it is today. If we cannot stand on the right thing, oh, we'll be saying, hey, America this, hey, UK this, hey, Canada this, Australia this, all these European countries, they are doing this and this and that. See, the level of corruption in this country, it is, it is, it is smelling, stinking. In all of those countries that we're talking about, not that they don't have, but, you know, isolated cases, they still have, but we will come with full chairs. We will always come with our full chairs. Even the ones that are not stealing, they will encourage the ones that are stealing. They will tell you, you have been in the office. What have you given to us? From where? Everybody, will, they will come with their food chairs. Yes. Yes. Yeah, it does not matter. Wait till they inside. Yeah, now, where person they walk, now they chop. We are encouraging it. When people begin to ask questions, they say, why are you asking questions? Forget it. This and this and that. Do you know a governor? Because other people have been doing it. They've been stealing money. And you think that is how it ought to be. That if this person can be bringing billions and be and be do doling out all manner of money, and you think other people need to do it, you begin to say, oh, that is the normal thing. So people need to ask questions. Where are they getting this money from? The last time we were talking about, himself was even talking about how Abmechi uh, drained River State to support Buhari in 2015. They are still on that. Thing. You begin to ask yourself, on what basis is all of this? Even in the research, are we supposed to be donating money for IDP camps? Why is it that these guys cannot go back to their houses? They have been there before Buhari came in. Some are there even when, during Buhari's time. Yet, we have not been able to win the war against all these insurgency. At the end of the day, we are donating money. I was supposed to be donating money for them or to be staying in that place. Even the money, is it going to reach them? That, that, that money that people have been donating left, right and center is enough for these people to go back to their houses. It's enough for, for us to, to tackle insecurity head on. But no, they won't do it. People will not be hailing him. Nigeria will not get better. Or if you continue to say, hey, forget it, hey, leave him alone, this and that, that, what is this? Other governors are doing it. Hey, what is uh -huh. If other governors, when they do it, you will see, say, no, they should leave them alone, that somebody else has done it and he goes away with it. So, all this, irrespective of how you like the person or you support the person, that does not take the fact that questions will not be asked. Questions will not be asked. <laughs> Someone say, responsible governor irresponsible governor <laughs> okay oh, equally make her here make her here or oh, make her here god have, I beg god have mercy this is this is uh, uh, unbelievable hmm. it's unbelievable it's unbelievable the way things are going in this country keep calling amechi try borrow sense like amechi wasting river state money for personal political gain which will not happen Come on, stop calling Amichi in. Was Amichi busy sharing money to every, everywhere he goes? You are a power. No, they share money in a different form. That is the problem. So because this is the most important thing that they are sharing money. Whether you came out with your food chest or whatever, it's inconsequential. But they share money. That is what is we are talking about. So guys, I don't want to talk much. Let's know your thoughts on this.